Hello you guys. So this is a recreation of a previous video I made for my girl B. Um, so this is going to be a soft spoken um, mouth sound. So you know if soft spoken has to have any significance, you know we also gotta have some yapping. So naturally I'm going to yap a bit so between the mouth sounds. Otherwise, you know what is the point of soft spoken soft spoken. So yeah. I think we should just get straight into it. Let me just... Which way does this go? Okay, I'm actually, because if I untie these, then it's just gonna drop immediately. But that's fine. It's just because I look like a, I look like an idiot when I do my sound, so... <laughs> sounds actually let's try to incorporate some cloth sounds but let's just let's give B at least some pure mouth sounds so need a haircut soon so <clears throat> so now for the soft spoken let's just incorporate it <laughs> so I just some of you might think that I just woke up from a very long coma but I just finished um, the Witcher 3 the wild hunt and I think it's very good um, I you know I didn't get the ending I wanted but you know I don't care because my head lore just takes you know parts of whatever ending I want, so you gotta have some head lore if you don't want to cry the whole night. So and naturally I chose Yen. Like come on now, you can't choose Triss Marigold. Even though she's the bigger mommy, you know, come on, Gerald, he loves Yennefer. So let him get Yennefer. And I've really enjoyed that thing where it is that where Dandelion he said, now they're just waking up at noon, getting breakfast in bed. And you might say that is boring. But that's what they sought after for so long. And I was like, come on now, Gerald. You finally got his piece. And also Jennifer, she deserved it. I was in that uh, universe, I definitely chosen Triss Marigold. It's just much more sweet. You know, Yen is also, you know, fantastic, but she's a little bit more sassy. 
and it also has its charms, right? But personally, I'm more of a kind, or I want a more kind girl than sassy. But whilst I loved Henry Cavill's, um, you know, uh, his role in The Witcher, I don't think they picked the right individual for Yennefer. I don't think she's, you know, she's not hot enough. Let's let's put it how it is, you know. Even after she became, you know, non non autistic, you know, with the, she kind of looked like the guy from, uh, you know, Notre Dame movie. You know, even after that, you know, didn't there wasn't that much to change, you know. But it's just my personal opinion. But Henry Cavill was a perfect choice. Let's put on these gloves. <clears throat> and I'm also going, or, you know, I don't know if it's end game, but I'm in act, the end of act three on the Baldur's Gate. I'm about to go on the road of Baldur's Gate. So I hope it's gonna be an absolute amazing journey on the Baldur's Gate or the road to Baldur's Gate. My apologies. Just trying to produce any kind of sound. B, if you hear me whisper, it's just because it's my second nature, you know. Excuse me, this once. But also guys, we are coming towards the end of the video. This is just a little bit of a short one. And um, <clears throat> I'll say thank you guys so much for watching. And you be, I hope you are satisfied with this video. But other than that guys, I'll see you next time. Bye.